Well, hey there team, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to some more Distant Worlds 2. We're looking at the preview build. It was fairly well received before. We did, you know, a bit of a broad overview and talked about some concepts, but I thought, hey, we can turn this into a bit of a mini-series if people are so interested. So we'll just jump in with a fresh start and sort of go through it and potentially put more episodes in with the, the more default uh, beer bones race. I can't remember what they are, the sort of the aquatic dudes. Um, so, uh, people did also mention that uh, it's quite dark in my recording. I'll, I'll do my best to boost it in post. There's not really any in-game settings to do anything about it, but you also have to remember there's a lot of sort of negative space that's black in this game. It is very dark anyway, but I, heard, I hear you and I will do what I can to boost it. So, let's, um, let's just go in again. We'll just do a default setting. Um, again, in this build, we only really have the two races. We're going to go these dudes uh, because they're pretty basic. And we'll just, let's have a bit of a squeeze here anyway. Aggression, you know, they're a bit soy, a bit limp-wristed. Uh, neutral, neutral, migration tendency. See, all this strikes me as AI behavior. Colonization, so they're big on oceans and deep ocean. That's kind of cool that deep ocean is a... You know, I look, I like that deep ocean planet. That's cool. Big research bonuses, uh, ship maintenance savings, and construction speed. They're quite negative to other races. Is everyone like that as well? Okay, yeah, right. So it's just to what degree of negativity do you bring to the table? Preferred governments, technocracy or republic. And then there's allowed governments. Default Infantry Defender Brigade. Okay, so a lot of this doesn't make much a huge difference out the gate or really mean much to me. Again, we'll just call these Gronk. That seems like a pretty good flag. We'll go with the default. I guess I could pick... Let's stick with Technocracy. Slower population growth. Better research. Generally not as happy. Uh, not as good as a mining rate. Technocracies are typically highly efficient and free from corruption. However, they often enforce tight control over the citizens' behavior. Yeah, okay. Loss of personal freedom can sometimes lead to unrest. Oh, you don't bloody say. Okay. Let's go. Let's get into it. Um, cool. Auto-generate. Off to the races. Right. Victory conditions. There you go. All right, well, let's just stick with that for the time being. Um, yeah, I, I mentioned this before. I really like that ship design. That's so cool. Something I'd build in Starbase. Jeez, now there's a game I could go back to. Holy heck. Factions known as Gronk. Yeah, this is all pretty stock standard stuff. So, yeah, let's get back into it. I know we're retreading ground a little bit. Okay, cool. Deep ocean planet. Oh, I like the sound of that. The ocean of the stars. I see what you did there. Tell me the location of the ancient Arcadian undersea city ruins. Is that not exactly where we are? Yeah, exactly. Dismiss. So let's see if I can remember my learnings. Starships constructed. Let's turn that speed right up to flat out. New leader appeared. We can just leave that crap go and sort of just let it happen. Um, I'm happy to build your recommendations uh, for the moment. Rebuild. We've got an ancient star port that we're going to rebuild. Um, while rebuilding the spaceport, workers have retrieved several interesting messages from logs. The logs use an unfamiliar dating system, but they appear to date from around 2000 years ago. At the time, the station detected massive, massive earthquakes and tsunamis on our planet's surface. These destroyed many undersea cities. Oh no. In addition, devastating planet plagues swept through the remaining population. A small crew was left on the base. The rest of the personnel took shuttles down to the planet to assist the population below. Eventually, the remaining crew lost contact with those on the surface. Life support was failing and the last members of the crew recorded that they were entering stasis in the hope of eventual rescue. With it, Acadian bodies have been found in damaged stasis pods on another part of the base. It's a little bit tragic, isn't it? Oh, so it goes. Well, now we've got this, which is not really building anything, is it? Maybe we tell it to build escort, build construction ship, exploration ship. Sell to build a construction ship. And this is already, oh wow, this is already building a bazillion things. 
There you go, now it's starting to queue stuff up. Okay, that's cool. The more construction ships, the better, in my opinion. Yes, it is very dark. Oh, we've got a planet over here to explore. Rocky Silicon Moon. Hmm. We, I don't think we have any mining sites discovered yet. No, nothing. Yeah, I don't know. The developers may end up watching this if they could. Yeah, some, some sort of gamma adjustment or something inside the game. I mean, it's kind of stock standard gamma and brightness. You know, I looked everywhere for it. It didn't have it. Again, it's an earlier build, so, you know, not the end of the world. Uh, show me this planet here or this thing. Here we go. Hang on. Let's task that. New construction ship completed. Uh, that's our warp field has uh, research, got some scientists, got some generals. That's building, that's building. Laurel raise the tax rate. Completely explored. Okay, so there's exploration levels. Hmm. No buildable facilities. Set colony automation, which it should already be automated. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Uh, it's building these ships. Yeah, so we sort of just let it run for the moment while I sit here and talk shit to you guys. Yeah, so this is queued up like crazy, building lots of these mining ships. I guess we'll just keep an eye on that. Hyperspace discovered. New scientists appear. Okay, it's starting to sort of just flesh out. Let's do that. We'll just take the advisor missions and just make sure we stay on top of the LV249. Oh, here we go. We're discovering a few bits and bobs here. They should pop up here because these are... Well, hang on. Glessu, let's do that. Let's task that immediately before... Yeah, there we go. Glessu, mining. Cool, cool, cool. Mining station queued to build here. Um, now, what is going on here? Mining ships galore. Yeah, that's already quite queued up, isn't it? Cancel building mining ship here. Mining station. Okay, so that's built. Hyper jumps ready. So that's interesting. It's kind of hard to track what's building what. Like, there was clearly something building there already, but we couldn't see... Who was doing it? Here we go. Assign mission. Let's just do that. All right, so we're starting to jump out here. Oh, that's interesting. We're in sort of the mid ring. I wonder what compelled them to go. Oh, Jesus, where are you guys going? Jeez, they're really going for it, aren't they? Okay, so let's just try and zip through this early game as quick as we can, since it is sort of retrod ground. We've got, hang on, that's not building anything. Let's uh, see, cancel building mining station. I don't see anything there, so let's queue a construction ship for now. Let's see how that goes. Junkyard encountered. Discuss a junkyard in our home system. The yard has a large base protecting it. A collection of ships lies scattered around the base in various states of disrepair. Base looks to be inhabited and active, preventing us from... Oh, okay, that's interesting. What are we going to do about that? Oh, ship is under attack. Show me. So this is an exploration ship. All right, we've got a little bit of combat. Jeez, it's lagging out. What is going on there? So there's the, the mining thing. Right click to send an exploration ship. Friendly resolution. Okay, so that's down. Oh, that's all the way out there. Right, now I believe our AI is going to kind of be smart enough to start manufacturing uh, military on autopilot. Mining station. But we will see. I should probably unpause, shouldn't I? Small freighter. 
Let's just let this build. Retrofit to SSP2. Okay, well, let's do that. Can I retrofit a mining station? No. Build exploration ships. Oh, here we go. Here we go here. Let's queue that up. Who was it? Dealer 2. We've got a few military problems to solve out there. Under construction. And I'm pause. Mining station constructed. Very good. Under attack. Construction ship. That's fine. Just need to sort of stand up a military. Let's wait for this to finish sort of retrofitting. Resource shortage. Fuel resource. Research, um, resource. Cast on. Castle on. There it goes. Here it goes. Right. So we're back to building here. What is that? Freighter. So perhaps I don't have any military capacity at all. Oh no, here we go. Hang on. Research station. Yeah, so I don't actually sort of officially have any uh, militarized vehicles. Early energy deflectors. Let's just let that... Well, actually, hang on. We can sort of control this a little bit, can't we? Armor plating. Construction. Basic mining, basic target tracking. So what's that do? Plus 25% research speed for this project. Why is it plus 25%? Hmm. Hmm. Space command. Basic command module fighter. Fighters and assault pods. Mm. Weapons. Early pulse weapons. Okay. Early energy deflectors. Yeah, maybe that's a prerequisite. It's not super clear. Shipboarding. It's not really super clear how we go about getting new models of uh, ships and all that sort of stuff. That might actually be a totally different thing. 100% sure. How are we doing out here? All right. Building none. That I don't like. That I don't like. Um... Give me another shipyard. Let's go. We're in the black as far as money goes, so that's good. Oh yeah, we're discovering some more resources. There we go, we'll queue that up. Yeah, so what are you doing? Mining ship. Under attack. Yeah, I can't I can't really do much about that game. Exploration. Construction ship. I might just keep churning out construction ships. Might be a little bit overkill. But until these all get resolved, I figure the more the merrier, right? economy okay there you go there you go our energy deflectors i don't suppose escort three so there we go we've got escort three escort well 
Actually, what am I doing? I just keep saying it. Research station constructed. Uh, I can build escorts. Uh, I should be, actually. They are the military ships. Let's build like four of them or something. Since people are getting kind of attacked. And they can sort of autopilot on their own anyway. What's going on here? Why are you red? Hang on, let's cancel some of these. Military ship constructed. Wonderful. So I believe we go to fleets. Century of dealer, right? Now that's already on full automation. You can see here we go, leave construction yard. No mission. However. Will he not figure out? Set tactics. There you go, Escort Arcane Shroud. Right, so they are going about their business, which is good. Discovery at Dealer 1, what is, oh hang on, what is going on here? Hidden Library at Dealer 1. Dealer, we've discovered a hidden library of Dealer. Ancient ruins from a lost civilization. Yeah, okay, should we investigate? Uh, yeah, absolutely, investigate it. In the hidden library, we have made a curious discovery. As our teams enter the ruins, a massive quake is mysteriously triggered at our home world in the same system. The quake has caused ex uh, extensive damage and has even damaged the quality of the planet itself. However, it has also changed aspects of our home world, actually making it more hospitable to our race. Oh, that's unusual. As a result, our home world now has a permanent population growth bonus. Ooh. Ooh, it's quite vague, isn't it, though? It's just better. These ruins provide the following colony bonus, plus, yep, yep, yep. We can acquire research bonuses by building a research station here. To obtain these bonuses, we should colonize the planet. Well, you know, I, I can't really argue with that. Now, what is this? We've discovered new resources here. That's right, that should come up in our mining menu here. Build mining station at dealer one. Private economy expense. Hmm. I wonder why that's red. Yeah, okay, so they're building mining ships galore now. Look at this, our little economy starting to stand up. Got a research station going here. Rocky moons, less than a star. Hmm, okay. A lot of this stuff doesn't make much sense to me yet, but we just need more research, I think. We just need more, right? Isn't that always the case? The fact that we're being attacked makes me think we need to build more escorts. Well, here we go. We've discovered a shitload of new sites, so that's good. build one two three four five or oh, you can see it in real time bringing your cash flow down um that's all right we'll be right we'll be right got this to queue up as well oh yeah more 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 discoveries Starting to really get amongst it now, isn't it? I haven't met anyone yet. Just haven't met you yet. First defense force, no mission. It's okay. Armor plating complete. What's next? Basic colonization. That sounds good. Show me what is going on here. Mining station. Research station disabled. No research bonuses here. Okay, let's keep that in mind. Oh, nice. Hundred 
tech. Scarlet Emperor. Oh, I like the sounds of that. Join it to the first defense. No. Idle, but there's not a lot for us to kill at the moment, so we might. Escort. Probably didn't need that, to be honest. I might uh, turn up the construction ships, eh? Push that economy down a bit. Can't afford it. Oh, look at this. I've run out of our float. That's a tricky one. But it looks like our mining industry is going to flourish. We just needed more ships, is all. Building none. Mm. Construction ship complete. Show me. Yeah, what's this bloke up to? Wait. Dealer 5. Here he is. There we go. Leave construction yard. Let's keep an eye on this bloke and see what he does. Vanishing Endeavor. It's kind of cool name. Build Quiet Prowler. There you go. Off he goes. So the work's there. The queue's just quite long. Yeah, look at this. We've only really built two of these. Oh, there you go. One ticked over then. So that's going to help our economy a fair bit. Go away. Oh, what is this? Building a spaceport. Double click to select. Ancient Acadian spaceport. How is that building? Did I misunderstand? Okay. No getting back up there. Yeah, look, now they're starting to tick over. It's just they have to make the, the trip all the way out there as well. You know, so that's worth considering. Hmm. I wonder if we can... I, I don't know if we have the tech to jump out of this planet. Or, you know, this, uh, well, solar system, right? Or system. Geez, where'd this cash injection come from? Game doesn't speed up when we zoom. No, it doesn't. It's always kind of slow. We doing colonization? Yeah, I really want to tick that over and see what that does. Oh, here we go. Malthur Outlaws. Be ashamed. Okay, yeah, right. So this is kind of very slow. Stellaris, <clears throat> excuse me. I feel like one of the first things you encounter are just local pirates. Um, and what do they want? They want stuff, and I say, uh, fuck you. We reject this deal. Goodbye. Um, now let's see what we can do with this fleet. Are you guys going to be smart enough to sort this out? Show me. This bloke's under attack. Oh, this station. Dangerous locations. Q threat investigation and clearance. No attack or raid fleet with adequate attack strength to take on defending forces location. Hmm. Do I need to? Can I merge this fleet? 
Fleet template. Fleet roll. Attack raid defend. Set tactics. Right, so we've got the individual ships and we've got the fleets. Strength 850. And strength 56. Jesus. Alright, let's go. Oh, here we go. We found another planet so we can get some serious stuff going on. I'm looking at the wrong one. I want this one. Pirates, eh? Right click to send first defense force to attack them. And we'll send the second defense force in as well. They're not quite full strength, but we'll send them anyway. I have concerns. Base raided. Is that this? Hmm. hmm. Where's that all happening? Out there. Okay. Let's uh let's scale up the old escorts, eh? That's going to put us in the red a little bit, but it might be worth it. Is this my station getting attacked? Oh, first contact. What's going on here? What do you want? Wait, are you... Uh, oh, you're pirates. Okay, whatever. I was going to say, you look like me. They offer us protection. No, I'm I'm good, thanks. I appreciate it. I do. Now, how's this going? New escort. Now, are you getting incorporated into my fleet, or what are you doing? Fleet templates. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like people are mobilizing. Construction ships. Manually controlled. Hang on. Will you automate, please? Have I changed the defaults somehow? Alright. Third defense force. That's interesting. Escort four. So it builds these fleets on its own. See see how it says manual? Fleet roll. What if we go defend? Move to dealer five. Here we go. There we go. What other modes do we have? Raid and invade and an attack. No, no. Defense sounds pretty good to me. Colonization tech discovered. Here we go. With the development of basic colonization, we've acquired the technology necessary to colonize new worlds. We should identify hospitable planets that are good candidates for new colonies and begin building colossal colony ships to send out to these new worlds. At this point, we have truly become a spacefaring civilization. As we move into the galaxy, we will continue to grow and gain the upper hand over pirates and mercenaries. Now has come the time, uh, now has come the age of expansion. We must compete against other empires. Right. Right. Well, first things bloody first. Sandra, clear my lunch. Uh, build construction ship, escort ship. G 
Jeez, look at this. Look at all the little civilian stations spewing up. Well, there's some combat going on down here somewhere. We've got the music for it. Um, fleets. Oh, look at this. Holy heck. It looks like we ticked over a whole bunch of them. Our, our economy's starting to burst. Ship construction. Hang on. So I can sort of do it from here, I guess. Under attack. I'm not really that worried. Colonies. Now, actually, if I were to click on an individual planet, build mining station, build research station. Did we not have candidates for colonization? Colonization suitability zero. Hmm. I thought we did have a candidate, did we not? Perhaps we don't. Okay. Look at this, it's all starting to kick off. What is that? Oh, defense force. Wonderful. Did we build enough to make another one? Strength 105, yeah. Damaged. Okay, cool. So I'm not really sure how we get the colonization ships. I'm going to go ahead and say I think it is contingent on us having a colonization uh, feasible target, which I don't think we have. Um, yeah, okay, cool. Not a bad start. Um, again, I know we started fresh, but we did zip past where we got up to before, and uh, if people are keen to see more of this, well, we'll just keep going with these same episodes. Again, apologies for the, the dark presentation. I can even see it in my other monitor, in my recording software. It's quite dark. Um, I, uh, hopefully, it's not even an issue when I fix it in post, but um, so it goes, I suppose. Such as, the, such as the case when you play a game set in the blackness of space. Anyway, let me know if you want to see some more team, otherwise I might just leave it there for the time being and I'll catch you guys on the next one.